Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Tonight, I want to show you guys how to use your Rodecaster Pro and your podcast setup to do Zoom calls. Everyone seems to be doing Zoom calls nowadays, and it's super hot at the moment. So I want to show you guys how you can use your Rodecaster Pro for this process. Let's get into it. All right, now we're live. We are on Zoom. It's a very easy setup. All you have to do is connect the USB to the USB-C in the Roadcaster. And then when you're in the Zoom, Zoom app, by the mute logo, you click the arrow and on select a speaker, you'll see Roadcaster Pro selected for the microphone and for the speaker. If you don't, uh, if you use the microphone but not the speaker, you're not going to be able to hear them in the headset. So, Chelsea, and hold on, uh, something special. We've got to welcome my wife on to the channel for the very first time. <laughs> <laughs> wrong one. No, hold on. <laughs> also wrong one. Let's see here. Yeah, there we go. Someone's new to all the soundboard stuff, and I just mixed them around. So we did mean to give you the clapping and applause, Chelsea. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Anything you got to say? I'm not sure what you'd like me to say. You sound <laughs> clear on my end. So I got to say, I'm doing all these tech videos and stuff, and she's a teacher, and they've moved all their classes online due to the coronavirus. Uh, what are some of the other apps you're using? I mean, you guys are on Zoom right now, right? Yeah. And yeah. what are, what are some of the other apps you guys are using to uh, still keep teaching your kids, but from a remote location? Well, elementary school is using Seesaw app, which allows us to give out assignments digitally and students to upload them digitally, and we can communicate with parents. And then high school is using Canvas. Awesome. And something I've been talking about to my other friend who works at Microsoft, the schools are now using Zoom. Uh, that's this video service that we're using right now. But uh, his recommendation was to use Microsoft Teams because supposedly it's a lot more secure. So I guess I'm not promoting Zoom right now, but I'm just showing you how to use the Roadcaster Pro while uh, doing Zoom. Speaking of my friend, uh, he just texted me, so now you're going to see that on the screen recording, I'm sure. <laughs> I'll probably edit that out. <laughs> Anything else you want to say before you sign off? No. Awesome. Uh, now, now I've got to try and figure out how to get all these clips together. Um, probably uh, watch the Enthusiasm Project uh, multicam video again to see if I can get all these spliced together. So, uh, Chelsea, thank you for joining the channel tonight, and uh, I'm sure we'll have you on again in the future. But thanks again. You're welcome. I'll end the meeting. Go ahead. End it. Thank you. Well, thank you for watching the video, guys. Uh, please give me a like. Please subscribe to this channel. There's going to be a whole lot more videos coming out on how I'm using my Rodecaster Pro. I'm really loving it. I have not found a single feature that is missing that I just can't live without. I mean, every single thing that I've used it for, it's exceeded my expectations. From the touchscreen to the sliders, everything's built with quality. I absolutely love the product, and it seems like with the updates coming out, I mean, people are already talking about the beta, and it seems like it just keeps getting better and better and better. And for my location down here in my basement, I've got a furnace right over here. It's roaring away right now. I've got a water softener over this way, and that's going off. And it seems to be doing a pretty good job of cutting all that noise in the background. So... The audio has been very good. I still need to get it dialed in. Uh, as you can see, uh, my shop is still a mess. I want to get everything moved and in a place where I can easily film 
with my computer out. I don't have to have it sitting on my lap, and I don't have to have the microphone hanging over my shoulder. Uh, hopefully, we can do a video on that in the in the future. Um, maybe I'll just surprise you guys someday and have a totally new setup. But uh, uh, thanks for watching, and uh, stay tuned for the next uh, episode. Um, let me know in the comments section below some of the things you'd like to see with this Roadcaster Pro. Is there any questions you guys have? Are, uh, are you thinking about buying it and uh, just have one question that's eating at you? Uh, please comment below. I'd be happy to answer or point you in the direction of where you can find the information. So uh, thanks again and talk to you guys next time. <laughs>